What's up everybody, MC John V1 here. Um so I got some awesome stuff for you guys today. Uh some uh three by three flush or I'll just say some three tall flush seamless doors. Plural. So this one the three by three flush seamless door. It is seamless open and closed because I put this uh three by three door CMB Minecraft 3x3 door in here, but, um, so that's the 3x3 door, here's the wiring, this one wasn't that tough, it was actually pretty easy, once I got the concept down, so the blue stuff is the 3x3, and then the purple stuff is the, um, 3x3 flush, seamless door, so, uh, yeah, and, forgot to say but I'm, I'm using the OCD texture pack, FV Disco's OCD texture pack and this works both ways uh, north and south and east and west so yeah that's that some nice nice that and then over here we got our lovely 4x4 or 3x4 Flush seamless door. This is actually faster than the other one. Very, I think. I think it's one of the fastest I've ever seen. Actually, oh, I just love it. Um, yeah, this wiring it's relatively the same size as the other one. It just goes wider on these pistons, trying to make it seamless. Um. Other than that, it's relatively the same. Just got we just got a double piston extender right here, and then uh, I'm fly around, and then this there's pistons. Yeah, close close for me. And these pistons work those, and then. We have these pistons up here which push down the other ones and use a bud uh, use a bud switch kind of mechanism to lower and extend the blocks into these positions. And then they just get pushed over by the piston tape right here. Um so yeah that works both ways as well. Now here's where it gets interesting. Yes. 5x3 piston seamless fl flush seamless door. So uh check this one. It's a lot slower because uh of the piston tape up there. I like this one though, it's really cool. Oh man, oh it's, it took me so long to figure this out. This door is it was in my nightmare. It was a nightmare. This whole section right here, from probably yeah, from this part right here, the block that I just surrounded, over to here, all the way over to about here. That whole section I just highlighted is only for this piston tape. And here I'll show you how this works. Here, let's see. Yeah, here, I'll click this button and I'll try to zoom up here. But it's just a lot of... All those redstone, uh... Redstone repeaters there, just pushing around everything. And it ends up with these three. So it's a triple piston extender with two normal pistons right here. So, yeah. So that's pretty sweet. But this, there's this weird thing about this. This door right here, only this door, it closes perfectly fine, but it doesn't open, it doesn't take this block, which is weird because, here, look, F3, I'm facing, as you can see, I'm facing the two, the two direction, so, um, give me about three seconds, and I'm gonna go over to my test world, I made these and I'm going to show you it working in the F2 direction. Alright, I'm back guys. It's nighttime here. And, uh, so, 
Look, I'm in the F2 direction, as you can see, right here. And, um, three, one, two. And watch this. And I literally just went into MC Edit, copied and pasted it. I don't understand why that happened. I'm thinking it has to do with MC Edit and it, just the way it copied and pasted didn't work. Um, but yeah, so those are those doors. Some sweet redstone action in here. Um, right now, I just recorded, or I'm about to record a video on a seamless 4x, or er, yeah. 4 high, 15 wide, piston door, and uh, that'll be out later, but you've probably seen this on Saturday, maybe Friday night, depends on when I, actually, I'm recording it on Friday night, but it probably won't be uploaded by then, but uh, yeah, so, I'm loving the texture pack, just gonna use it for redstone stuff though, and um, so I'm gonna see you guys later. I'm going to leave you with this, and, um, ooh, I'm going to, sh I don't want to show you everything else, you might have just saw it, um, where is it, um, um, whoop, little clock going over there, um, yeah, so, this whole area right here, where all my tests for the five by three, just random tests. That was my first design. Uh, yep, test world. You've seen all that stuff, but there's stuff behind it that I don't want to show you yet. Um, we're gonna hit and stare design that. Oh, there it is. Okay. So yeah, that was all that test, and this is I love this little place I made. I was bored. I ran out of ideas, so I just started making this place look all nice. So this is my 4x3, and um, so I got this, oh, that one's close, pressure plates will close it, too far away to hear the pistons, but this button opens all of them, some glitchy pistons, and it closes all of them. Um, yep. What you see right there, over in the corner over there, is not what I'm trying to hide. That's the 5x5. Five five. But yeah, also I have this whole mechanism. Just start walking. The door is perfectly open by the time you get there. And, uh, so, I will work on a world download for that world. See if I can get that one, uh, thing, that one door fixed. But if I can't, um... I might still put up the world download, but just so you know that that door doesn't work right there. So if you're gonna copy it with MC Edit or something, copy the other door um, and just try to rotate it and see if it works for you. But it's I've copied and pasted it maybe four or five times and it didn't work still. So, but other than that, I'm gonna see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like. If you have any questions about it, leave a comment. And um, to see other doors in the future and other uh, series, maybe Let's Play and stuff like that, uh, you might want to subscribe because got some good content. And uh, as the sun rises on the tree, oh, that is beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, that deserves a screenshot. Bye-bye, everybody.